Well, hello. Who is the most paid spy on American soil? Who betrayed the CIA in 1994? If you answered Eldritch Ames for any of those questions, you have it right. Eldridge Ames, also known as Rick, was put into a farm, also known as a CIA training camp, where he could be eligible for the CIA. Even though he really didn't have to do this because his dad got him a job as records analyst when he was 16 in his sophomore year in high school. When they moved from Wisconsin to Virginia to the CIA headquarters, his dad got the job. His dad thought he could use a job and use up his summers as a records analyst. Now, I have set up a little interview with a former CIA member to see how what exactly happened to out to Rick during these years, his 31 years of being a CIA member. Ken, how are you today? Oh, I'm just fine. What's yourself? I'm good. Good. Well, I've got a few facts for you today that are probably going to be helpful for you. Really? Can I ask a few questions about those facts? Yeah, sure. Go ahead. Okay. Um, how long have you known Alger James? Um, 13 to 14 years, probably. So you have a pretty strong heart about him. Yes, yes. It was definitely. What was your first reaction when you found out about him? Honestly, I was shocked. I never thought he would sell information to the Russian KGB. How long was he selling information? Well, Connor, that's a hard question to ask. The CIA doesn't even know that. Now, can you tell me what he leaked? Sorry, but no. That, all I can say is that it's classified information and it can't be spread. Can you tell me how much money he gained from this? Actually, I can. He gained about $2.5 million in about nine years. That is a lot of money. A significant amount, I might add. Now, how did the CIA be aware of the fact that the information was leaking? Well, they looked over everybody and saw that he was planning monthly meeting with the Russian governor. And seeing that, they looked into his bank records and saw $50,000 going into his account every month. So that's like a huge red flag for the CIA. Yes, definitely. How did Aldridge be aware of the fact that he was being watched? Well, honestly, he didn't. The DO, also known as the Director of Operations, kept it as a secret. Now, is it true that the CIA will prosecute physically to members that leak information? No, absolutely not. The CIA is looking for where the dangers are in the world. Thank you. We will come back after a short break and video on what really happened to Aldridge Ames in 1994. <laughs> Here we are back with Ken Smith telling us what really happened in 1994. Ken, so, can the CIA, so the CIA can't make arrests? That is true. When the CIA finally got enough evidence to go against Aldridge, they put the case into the FBI's hands. So how did they even catch him? Well, since they knew he was going to another trip to Turkey, they had to get him quick. I see. His boss arranged the meeting with Aldridge talk about his trip overseas. When Aldridge got around to the corner of the street, the FBI took him into custody. How did everyone feel that he was going to prison? Well, the members of the CIA were relieved that he was finally going to jail. And how long will he be in prison? For the rest of his life, with no chance of parole. Really? Yes. That is a long time for him to spend time in jail. It most definitely is. Well, thank you for coming in, Ken, today. And thank you for having me, and I'm glad to have and share my information. Well, thank you for watching what actually really happened in 1994 to Alex Haynes when he got arrested for leaking information. Thank you, Ken Smith, for doing that interview with me. And thank everyone for watching.
Uh, <laughs> there it came out. Long end. Dude, it's so stuff. good. Like whenever I thought I was laughing, I would look down the page. Yeah, I'm just trying to like... <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. Is it recording? <laughs> they need a little light in the front. Yeah, it's recording. It does. Like a little orange light or something. Uh -huh. Yeah, it's funny. Why does Connor need information? Well, Connor, that's a hard question. Even the CIA doesn't know that. Now, can you tell me what he leaked out? Sorry, but no. That. <laughs> where'd you stop at? Sorry, but no. Why'd you stop? I don't know. I'm just like, I just froze? Yeah. He's selling information. Well, Connor, that's a hard question to answer. Good, because I was starting to laugh. Like, we're yeah. disappointed in the show. <laughs>